Several people are dead and nearly 500,000 are waiting for their electricity to be restored after a storm swept through the northeast. Utility crews started pushing through fallen trees and debris Saturday night to reach power lines down by strong winds and heavy rain. We're telling them to stay in, be patient. If they have down power lines, stay away from them. Just call it in by cell phone. We're getting them as quickly as possible. 70 mile an hour winds knocked awnings off of these businesses and sent patio sets flying. The furniture in my backyard is going around in circle. So like it's, a I, ne I never saw anything like it. And the nonstop downpour prompted flood warnings for several areas through Sunday evening. I don't even dare drive through it and it's coming up like I've never seen it in a very long time. With the snow, the rain, everything being so wet. You don't know what's going to happen. The weather is being blamed in the deaths of several people. In New Jersey, two people were killed by a falling tree as they walked through this neighborhood. We heard a crash that sounded actually like a garbage can blowing, but I think it was the sound of the tree either hitting a car or something. Another person was killed in Westport, Connecticut after a tree fell on a car. The weekend storm, which battered parts of Pennsylvania, New Jersey, New York, and Connecticut, struck about two weeks after heavy snow and hurricane force winds wreaked havoc on the region. Tim McGuire, the Associated Press.